Iran's vice president and head of the Iranian Environmental Protection Agency, Ali Salashka, on Monday, May 30th, arrived in Damascus with a high-level delegation on an official visit. Salashka met with senior Syrian officials to discuss mechanisms to deal with climate change and ways to increase cooperation between the two countries. Our correspondent, Tisa Monous, gives us the details. The discussions between the Iranian official and the Syrian Prime Minister, Hussein Arnouz, and with the Syrian Environment Minister focused on ways to develop cooperation to counteract the effects of climate change, in particular sandstorms, desertification and drought. Both sides agreed on terrorism and the U.S. occupation of parts of Syria being the main reasons aside environmental damage and air pollution due to indiscriminate oil refining, illegal logging, forest fires and the mishandling of water resources. Taking into account the increased intensity of weather phenomena in recent years and the density of sandstorms that hit our countries on any given day, we have deemed it appropriate to increase cooperation on environmental issues and to activate all bilateral pertinent agreements previously signed. We need to define and enforce an executive plan that will allow us to take advantage of the accumulated experience of our two countries in dealing with sandstorms and benefit from that experience in order to deal with this phenomenon which affects society, the economy, health and vegetation. The Iranian vice president restated his country's firm support to Syria in combating terrorism and in its efforts to overcome the hardships brought on by economic sanctions from the West. At the meeting with Syrian Foreign Minister Faisal al-Meghdad, Salah noted that collaboration on environmental issues is part of strategic cooperation between two countries who are allies on political, economic, commercial and military issues for the sake of the respective nations. Our two countries share excellent relations in all areas, not just at the political and military level. Damascus and Tehran have strategic relations, which means that the two countries maintain constant consultations on issues of common interest, including emerging issues such as environmental protection, sandstorms, desertification and drought. This visit takes place two months after a visit by Iranian Foreign Minister Hussein Amir Abdullahian to Damascus, and at a time when Tehran is hosting a meeting for the development of Syrian-Iranian economic and trade relations. A sharp increase in bilateral contacts and consultation points to a strong alliance between Syria and Iran and shows that both countries are determined to carry cooperation forward in defiance of sanctions from the West.